All right, we're not cooking snakes today, but something you might think is pretty close, the snakehead fish. You may be asking yourself, what in the world is a snakehead? Indigenous to Asia and Africa, snakeheads were found to be invasive in the Potomac River region of Maryland and Virginia. The northern snakehead, the most common of the species, has also found its way into waterways in Georgia, Florida, and most recently northern parts of Louisiana. Strongly resembling a shoe pick or bowfin, the snakehead has an elongated body but is set apart by long fins on both the top and bottom. It has the head of a speckled trout with jaws like teeth and a scale pattern similar to a python, making the snakehead creature sure to catch the attention of any adventurous outdoorsman. But how do they taste? Well, our friend Chef Philippe Parola, with his motto, can't beat em, eat em, is the perfect guy to share a recipe for this peculiar aquatic creature. Talk a little bit about this fish. This is yeah. an invasive species. The first one was discovered in Louisiana, up in Concordia. What do the biologists say about the future of these things moving in further and becoming more prolific? Well, this is what I know. I'm not a biologist by any means, but I'm a chef and I'm a sportsman. That's why I'm involved with invasive species in general. Uh, here it is. To me, this fish is fun to catch. I've seen it. Uh, look at, the, I mean, they, they will take any bait you can throw at them, literally. How long do you think it'll be before they get prolific in Louisiana? Or do you think maybe they're here? We've got I, a population. I, I, Don, I think after all the years I've been working with invasive species, I think that these fish will never get to the point of being prolific, simply because, again, it's easy to catch, it's fun to catch, it's good to eat. We're going to show you that. I, I don't see these fish to, be a, to become a problem. Uh, actually, in Maryland, it's already on the menu in several restaurants. So chefs already adapt to it. So. I have Julian vegetable here with some cherry tomatoes, okay? And uh, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna put some Cajun seasoning. Olive oil, that's it. All right, we got the fish gutted. We got it scaled. Mm -hmm. What are you doing here now, Chef? There's a seasoning inside out there, that's all. Put a little bit of olive oil inside, just to kind of make it moist, keep it moist. And we're gonna put it now on a barbecue pit, all right? The whole fish, right here. And so now, what we have to do, come up and put the fish to boil. All right, put that. there she goes. How Give long do you think it's gonna take? 30 minutes. 35 minutes, we'll be fine. Stick around, we'll be back to give you a little bit of sample of our snakehead fish. Okay, Chef, how long has it been on the grill now? A good uh, 35, 40 minutes, I would say. Mm -hmm. and you can see how too. sizzling it is, and it's, I mean, it's really beautiful, but the smell, mm. huh? Yeah, it is. Look at how beautiful and mm, white mm, the meat mm. is, right? So. Ready? All right, we're gonna put one piece. Still ready? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put a little vegetable on top. A couple of those nice little tomatoes there. And then we're gonna squeeze a little bit of lemon juice on it, you see like this? And a drop of olive oil. That's it. And now you got the most healthiest fish you can have. And busy species, there you go. Let's <laughs> see what snakehead tastes like. <laughs> What like do you think? Tastes like chicken. No, kidding. Well, I tell you, that is a very unique taste. I know. I can't compare it to any other fish I've ate, but it's good. It's delicious. 
I mean, uh, and, and look at how beautiful that, that the, the dish looked like. Well, let's get an unbiased opinion over uh, here. You I go ahead here. with uh, with my buddy. Dave Rosto from Fred's on the River. You've cooked everything you can imagine that walks, flies, swims, or crawls. Here, <laughs> give us an opinion on this snakehead. Well, let me say this, Don. Now, Philippe, I've known for quite a long time. And uh, every now and then, Philippe will call and say, David, I got something I want to cook down at Fred's. Snakehead dish. Imagine that. That's not, I'm trying to see what I can I, I, it. It's a different, it's a unique taste to me, but it's a good flavor. Very good. Good job on that, Chef. Very good job. There you have it, snakehead fish snakehead coming to fish. a bayou and maybe a dinner table near you.